Hello and welcome back to the channel. Today I've just had a delivery, um, so let's go through today's little mini haul. So I'm going to start up first with the Indicator Series release of Hammer Volume 5 Death and Deceit. So I recently did Volume, five, uh, volume 6, so I've managed to pick up Volume 5 for a reasonable price. Um, so let's rip it open before we have a look at the movies and see what scans indicated have given us on these old Hammer films. Okay, so this is a limited edition, uh, 4,721 out of 6,000. So on this one, we have Visa to Canton. We have the Pirates of Blood River, the Scarlet Blade, and the Brigand of Kandahar. I think that is. Please forgive me if I've got the pronunciations wrong. Um, take the little mini slip off. So this is the sturdy outer box. It says a quick look at the specifications. They're all HD masters. So not 4K, not 2K, uh, HD. Uh, so 1080p, original mono, um, two presentations of Visa to Canton with the rarely seen original UK title sequence and the alternative US passport to China titles. Um, then two presentations of the Scarlet Blade and so on. So look at the bottom. Okay, so closer look at the front. Some nice artwork here. And look at the spine. And the underneath. Okay, so slide the discs out to show the case. So it is a sturdy cardboard box. I'll put that over there for now. So onto the first one of four. Okay, so inside we have the disc and alternative artwork. And we have the booklet. So these sets always come with great books. Uh, well worth a read, obviously after you've watched the movie. So this master was done by Sony for the indicator series. So slide that back in there. That's the first one. Second up. Okay, Christopher Lee's in this one. Let's look at the back. As you can see, full height cases used. Um, I much prefer those by Scanavo. So take the disc out, reveal the alternative artwork. And the booklet for this one. So again, Sony have done the remaster. And the encoding work by Indicator, which is usually of top quality. Third one. Oliver Reed is in this one, the big standout name. That's the alternative artwork. There's Oliver Reed on the front. Studio Canal have done the remaster on this one. Okay, 
And the last one. It is the Brigand of Kandahar. Okay. Oliver Reed in this one as well. Studio Canal logo on this one. And there's a look at the alternative artwork. And the last booklet. This one also by Studio Canal Remaster. So again, another nice set um, to add for the Hammer Films. So looking forward to watching those films, checking them out. Okay, moving on. Um, picked up this book on the cheap. Um, huge um, fan of the Wes Anderson films. Um, obviously ranging from Bottle Rocket up to Grand Budapest Hotel. Uh, looking forward to the new movie coming out soon. My favourite, of course, is Rushmore. Um, just think the chemistry between Jason Schwartzman and Bill Murray and the excellent score, which I can't rate enough, um, just really sets it off as my favourite. Um, so really wanted to add this book. I have got the Grand Budapest Hotel book. Um, but wanted to add this one to the collection. Got quite a few books now. Okay, so just have a quick look through it. Okay, so there's all the characters, including uh, characters from Fantastic Mr. Fox, which again is a very good movie. Uh, the animation quite quirky, um, does make me laugh. Life Aquatic, The Dajin Limited, Fantastic Mr. Fox, I think that's Moonrise Kingdom, yeah, great films, really are. So really looking forward to reading this book going through each of the films how many pages is this one have I got a page count Yeah, we've got a page number up there, 324. So, yeah, going to be a good read, that. Very nice book. And finally, um, picked up the Australian uh, Blu-ray release of um, Richard Donner's film, Timeland, uh, Timeline. Sorry. Um, obviously, not many people like it. Didn't get good reviews, but does have some good moments and um, I really wanted to see this one again after many years. So we rip this open. Let's have a look what imprints have done for this release. Okay, so a nice glossy slip box. Slip box because only one side is open. Not slip cover. Nice gloss work on that. So yeah, Paul Walker, Francis O'Connor, and Gerard Butler and Billy Connolly in this one. If you've not seen it, so. Slide it out to really see the keep case. Okay, different artwork on this one. It's 18 year old now, this film. 
Okay, so that's basically what it's about. Paramount have done a 1080p high definition transfer for this one. We have a DTS HD master, uh, sorry, DTS HD 5.1 surround. I'm assuming it's master audio. Um, I won't know till I check it out. It could be high resolution, but maybe unlikely. Uh, and a lossless LPCM stereo track. Okay, so inside, there's the disc. And we have internal artwork. So this will replace my UK DVD now. So finally glad to have a Blu-ray version of the film. Anyway, so that's a quick look at today's haul. Um, thanks for watching. Please like and comment and um, subscribe for more. And I'll see you again soon. Goodbye.